foot before you start putting your paddle in the water. But you don't need to wedge, all you're doing is the power transfer yeah, on your strokes. Before you get to the end, I want you to stop and battle, uh, before you get to the end there and stop within four backward strokes. Right, so again, power stop again. That power transfer, what I want you for now is practice that again, but I want you to paddle along this line. You've got to keep to the line and stop before the end there. Next month on the uh, 12th. Oh, that makes it. That makes it. Yeah, it's the 12th. Come on then, practice again. Right. Okay, Neil, do that again, but do it blind. And you're going to stop at the other end. And don't peep. You're going to do it blind. Right. Look at where you are now. Right. So, what happened there, Neil? Do you think where you ended up over there? Right. Yeah, right, okay. So, what are you going to do to ensure that doesn't happen again? Slow it down, maybe? Just feel your way forward. Just close your eyes and feel your way forward. All right, before you stop, to you start, look at the distance, get an image in your mind where you're going to stop. All right, close your eyes. Right, Neil, St so you careered into here, didn't you? What was the reason for that? Is one side stronger than the other? Right, so do a shorter, shorter stroke. Do you remember I talked about doing a shorter stroke? And, and get a feel of how one side is more powerful than the other. So slow it down. Right. Do you feel yourself careering off again to your left? So you've got to slow the stroke down, get a feel of it, and also, yeah, yeah, it's, it's your foot, you're probably putting too much power on the right side, on your foot, to, uh, to the left. So it's coming initially from here, it's coming in too, too powerful on, on your right side. Right, Rob. Uh, have you demonstrated going blind down there yet? Well, do it again. This practice, practice.
Right, so stop Neil. What do you think about that one? Have you got the feel of the paddle, the power? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So you're getting the feel of the power that you're putting into your stroke, particularly, you know, where you've got to do, you've got to be aware that this side power is stronger than this side, and that's why you're careering off. So you have to let. Yeah, yeah. But you're getting the feel. Yeah. Right. So go, you know, keep practicing that feel of it. Right, Rob, come on. Mind. Straight arm. You got to body transfer. We uh, stop now, Rob. See where you're going. Oh, no, you're going off. So what are you doing? Are you you're putting too much power on your right side or your left side? Right. So remember the density of the water is lighter, isn't it? The power you've got you will need in white water. But you don't need this power when you've got water like this. Yeah, well try to do it now without closing your eyes. So get that feel where you're getting the balance between the two. Because you went a little bit off there. When you were your eyes were closed, you had a better balance going forward. Yeah, yeah. Right. So come on Rob, I want to see the stub in the fish. Yeah. Try a shorter stroke. You maybe put because um, what happens? You're putting in a longer stroke here on the right, uh, and then suddenly you're going to start over this side to pull it back straight again. Use the lines, Neil. Use this line here. <coughs> the balance is the balance of your your power is in your feet. You may have to take the pressure off the the brake off your foot a little bit more on your right.
Right, Rob, what I want you to do now, when Leo comes back, Yeah, it's 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 like what do you think about it? It's the the pressure. It, yeah. Okay. Next exercise is combine the two here. Just borrow your your paddle a bit, Rob, or or I'll use that one because I'm used to that one. Okay. How do you do a backwards paddle? So where do you start it from? Your hip? Yeah. And you know about the pivot spot, don't you? Yeah, and you know where you got three stripes, haven't you? Right, so with this you only take it you only take it to from the hip here to there and then switch it to there and to there. Right, and it's you, you. You still use, you're still using your feet like this, the same movements as you do, but you've, it, it's getting the balance between the pressure you put on your feet, particularly if one side is stronger than the other. So you you come from here, you look there, and you you push it here, and you get that sort of cycling movement going like this. If I do it here, so it's here, yeah, to the hip here, and then it's, you're, you're using your trunk rotation. So you you know, the power transfer is the same from starting from your bum, yeah, from here, and then putting on this foot here, like that. So. Forward paddle down to there in a straight line, following these lines. Get to the bottom by stopping, then to practice coming backwards. And it's all about slowing it down. All right. So pick yourself a line. Right, stop a second. What happened there, do you think? What happened there? Yeah, and then you... It's, don't forget, if you go beyond a certain point here, the boat will start to turn. So you, the shores of the stroke are the better because you go past a certain point, the boat will start to turn. Yeah, you only go lightly sort of push it. That's much better, Rob. All right, forward again, keep to the line, and then reverse. On, off again. It's all about that feel of the paddle and the power, the transfer power.
Okay. You're paddling nicely in a straight line, Rob, uh, Neil. And uh, your paddle movement is slowed down. Try a little bit more of the trunk rotation with your feet coming round like that. Okay, on particularly on the backward stroke. So you're doing a trunk rotation on forward, but try that on the reverse. So Rob, good control there of going forward, isn't it? And coming back. I'll have a look at it again. So try and do a shorter stroke with a trunk rotation, maybe only that much. No, just reverse. Forward is fine, it's coming along nicely now. Yeah? Getting some good control there, Rob, coming 